<laughs> On our way down. Zoom it. About to go in the gondolas. Are you guys ready? Construction on the Royal Gorge Bridge began on June 5th, 1929. Work crews began working on each side of the gorge, building towers with the newest technology available. Half-inch steel cables were lowered from both sides of the canyon. The ends were joined at the bottom of the gorge, and then the cables were pulled back up, completing the first strand across the gorge. In under seven months, the Royal Gorge Bridge was built by a hardy band of about 80 men with no serious injuries or fatalities. Are you three in a group? Yes, we are. You're going to go ahead and take this last car later. Last car? Yep, the last one. Gondolo! Whoa! Oh my goodness! Yeah. Sorry, can I spread those seats real quick? Oh yeah, yeah. Just want to make sure. Oh my goodness! Does it feel this wobbly? No, it's okay. Are you I'm sure? Save, I promise. Okay. Oh my god! All right. All done. Oh no, that's probably dead. I don't know. Probably gets heavy. Can I sit wherever? Are you guys ready? Yeah. Daniel? Yeah. Alright, everybody, we're going to do it all the time while the gondola is moving. Watch out for closing and opening oh, doors. Uh, when you get to the end on the other side, they're going to let you out one cap. You look scared. Hmm? You look so scared. Do you have more scared? That's why you made out paper. Okay. Yeah. I'm not scared, guys. <laughs> okay. I'm not scared at all. <laughs> <laughs> Just a little bit. I love heights. <laughs> I do Smile. Not hear her Smile. Either. I just did. I missed it. Smile. The Royal Gorge is a world famous geological formation that has fascinated man since the beginning of time. With walls towering over a thousand feet above the Arkansas River, the length of the gorge is about 10 miles. The formation of the Royal Gorge is a story of seas, plains, and mountains with intense upheavals and extensive erosion. <laughs> <laughs> Holy moly, guys. Did you see it? Like, uh -huh. there's a train on there, too. Very cool. Guys, are you yeah, nervous? Cool. This is the bridge. We just went all the way across this, guys. <laughs> no smoking, bro. How are you doing on this trip? Fine. Did you like it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's pretty cool. I think they liked it. I don't know about that bridge, though. <laughs> <laughs> now we're gonna go across the bridge over there, guys. Where's it at? Oh my god, I can't even see it. We're too far away. <sighs> oh! oh my god. <laughs> Whoa, Nafino, do you feel that? Yeah, I feel that. <laughs> <laughs> we're rocky. Good thing I. Alright, thank you for your patience. Like your cabin is off to your right down the stairs. Hey, may I record you? How high are we? Uh, let's see. I'm just I curious. I think it's about 6,200 feet. 6,200 feet, guys, all the way down. Rode in the gondolas. About to walk right across that. Wow. 
I'll take a family picture near the edge. Yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, definitely, definitely There's just some little gaps here in the book. <laughs> look at the beautiful view. It's oh, look so how big up. this yeah, gap is though. Yeah. It's huge. The bridge is 1,260 feet long, 18 feet wide, and can hold more than 2 million pounds. The deck of the bridge hangs 956 feet over the Arkansas River with 1,000 tons of steel on the floor of the bridge. 2,100 strands of number nine galvanized wire make up each cable. The towers are 150 feet high, holding two cables weighing 300 tons. <laughs> Nathaniel, what is wrong? She wants a picture. Do you guys feel it wobbly? Yes. What do you want? Are you filming? <laughs> no, no, I'm taking a picture. Jeez. Oh, you feel it? I wouldn't record you. Yeah, oh yeah, take on you. Oh yeah, sure. You guys ready? Yeah. Towering cliffs rise high into the air, forming the picturesque setting for the Arkansas River, which winds its way through the rocky shore a thousand feet below. Daredevil Ben Moon, whose specialty is stunning, decides to give the folks a real thrill. So he hangs a trapeze over the side of the bridge, where a swiftler means certain death. After warming up a little, he goes through the routine of a trapeze artist. You can't find anything too hazardous for Ben. It's child's play with him. And he wouldn't give up the opportunity of risking his neck for anybody. It takes a lot to amuse some people. But Ben enjoys it. His life is just one big thrill after another. It's the sort of thing that's fun to watch. 